The universe is a battlefield of chaos. Its secrets are locked in storms of fire and light. One mind dared to face them. In a world bound by order, one man saw truth in disorder. His ideas were dangerous. They challenged everything. His enemies called him a heretic. His discoveries sparked a war. The cost of truth was higher than he knew. This is the story of genius against the world. The man who changed science forever. His name was Ludwig Boltzmann. In Vienna, on a snowy night in 1844, Ludwig Boltzmann was born. His parents saw a bright future in his tiny eyes. This child would one day challenge the world's greatest minds. As a boy, Ludwig was endlessly curious, always asking why things moved or fell. The world was a puzzle he longed to solve. His mind was already racing toward greatness. In school, Ludwig's talent shone like a star. Numbers and patterns came easily to him, sparking dreams of unlocking nature's secrets. He was destined for something extraordinary. At Vienna University, Ludwig soaked up knowledge, but old science ideas felt wrong. He believed tiny atoms ruled the world, a theory most laughed at. His rebellion was just beginning. Night after night, Ludwig wrestled with atoms, invisible bits that explained everything. Scientists called his ideas foolish, but he pushed harder. The truth was out there, waiting for him. Ludwig's bold theories sparked fights with his teachers, who refused to believe in atoms. He stood tall, defending his ideas with fire in his heart. The world wasn't ready for his genius yet. In smoky cafes, Ludwig shared his dreams of a new science, where atoms danced in chaos. His friends saw a spark that could change everything, he was so close to a breakthrough. In a flash of brilliance, Ludwig cracked the code, the Boltzmann equation, explaining the chaos of atoms. His discovery would rewrite science forever. A legend was born. Boltzmann's ideas are the basis of all modern atomic and statistical physics. In the 1870s, Ludwig Boltzmann became a professor in Graz, a rising star in science. His equation about atoms was gaining attention. He was ready to share his ideas with the world. Ludwig taught with fire, explaining how atoms move and collide to create everything. His students were inspired, hanging on his every word but not everyone was convinced. Leading scientists attacked Ludwig's atom theory, calling it unproven and wild. Scientists like Ernst Mach and Wilhelm Ostwald attacked Ludwig's ideas, saying atoms were just a fantasy. Mach demanded proof he could see, while Ostwald pushed energetics, claiming energy, not atoms, explained everything. Ludwig defended his work, his voice steady, but his hands trembling. Alone, Ludwig wrestled with doubt, wondering if he was wrong. The weight of rejection pressed hard on him, but his belief in atoms kept him pushing forward. In his lab, Ludwig tested his ideas, watching gases behave as his equation predicted. Each success fueled his courage to fight on. He was proving the impossible. 
In public debates, Ludwig faced his rivals head-on, defending his atoms with fierce logic. Some in the crowd cheered, others jeered. The battle for science was heating up. At home, Ludwig found strength in his family, who believed in his dreams. Henrietta urged him to keep fighting for his truth. Their love gave him hope. In a burst of genius, Ludwig unveiled entropy, showing how atoms drive the universe's disorder. His work shook science to its core. He was unstoppable now. He was a great man, and perhaps too human for this world. In the 1880s, Ludwig Boltzmann's name echoed across Europe, his atom theories gaining ground. Universities invited him to speak, hailing his entropy ideas as revolutionary. But with fame came pressure to prove he was right. Ludwig's lectures dazzled crowds, his passion for atoms lighting up rooms. He explained how entropy ruled the universe's chaos, inspiring a new generation. Yet some in the crowd whispered doubts, ready to challenge him. Old rivals like Ernst Mach refused to accept atoms, calling Ludwig's work unprovable. Their debates grew personal, shaking Ludwig's confidence. He fought on, determined to defend his life's work. The constant battles took a toll on Ludwig's mind, plunging him into dark moods. He felt alone, even as his ideas spread. His family worried, but he hid his pain, driven to keep working. Teaching gave Ludwig joy as he guided young minds to embrace atoms and entropy. His students adored him, calling him a visionary. Their belief rekindled his fire. As Ludwig's fame grew, so did the attacks, with some scientists labelling him a dreamer. The weight of proving atoms real crushed him, yet he refused to give up, even as storms closed in. Across the world, scientists like Maxwell's allies rallied behind Ludwig, praising his entropy work. Their support gave him strength to face his enemies. He knew he wasn't alone anymore. In a blazing moment, Ludwig linked entropy to the universe's flow of time, stunning the world. His ideas were no longer just science. They were philosophy, changing how we see existence. He stood taller, ready for what came next. Boltzmann was one of the most daring and profound thinkers I ever met. In the early 1900s, Ludwig Boltzmann's lectures still captivated Europe's brightest minds. His ideas about atoms and entropy were finally gaining ground. But years of fighting had left him tired, his spirit worn thin. Ludwig's mind, once a blazing fire, now battled dark storms of doubt and depression. The weight of endless criticism crushed him. He felt his work might never be fully accepted. At home, Ludwig's family saw his pain, urging him to rest and find peace. Henrietta held his hand, reminding him of his greatness. But the darkness in his mind grew harder to fight. Slowly, the tide turned, with younger scientists embracing Ludwig's atoms and entropy. They saw him as a pioneer, building on his ideas. For a moment, he felt hope flicker again. In his final years, Ludwig poured his heart into writing, defending his life's work with every ounce of strength. He knew his ideas were true, even if the world wasn't ready. His pen was his last weapon. In 1906, Ludwig's battle ended in tragedy when he took his own life at 62. 
His family and friends were shattered, left with grief. The world lost a giant too soon. After his death, Ludwig's ideas triumphed as atoms became science's foundation. His entropy explained the universe's chaos, inspiring countless discoveries. His name was carved into history. Ludwig Boltzmann's life was a blaze of courage, his mind a spark that lit the universe's secrets. His equations unlocked the dance of atoms and the arrow of time, shaping science forever. From classrooms to the stars, his brilliance lives on, a legacy that will never fade. If this story moved you even a little, please consider liking the video, especially our loyal subscribers who see it first. It really helps the algorithm share it with more people who might need to hear it. And if it didn't resonate with you, we'd still love to hear your thoughts. Honest feedback helps us improve and make better content. If you'd like to see more stories like this, you know where to find us. You can also reach out on social media. Links are on the screen and in the description. We'd love to connect. Thanks for being here. Stay thoughtful. Stay curious.